It's time for more Hidden Expedition. We're playing the sixth in the series. This is Smithsonian Hope Diamond. So we're actually in front of the Smithsonian uh, Castle, I think it was. Yeah, if we want to look at our inventory, we have a Liberty Quarter, 1992 it looks like. Two out of four uh, bobbleheads. We have a dime and a key card. So I'm wondering if we're going to have to collect all the American change here. I believe that's George Washington, maybe? I'm not sure. I don't know the American money that well, because I'm Canadian. But, uh, yeah, well, actually, I'm familiar with the American money, because I've been there many, many times, and obviously have spent many, many dollars down there. In lovely America. So let's go ahead and stick this key card in here. Dr. Blue. Walking forward. Well, that was creepy. Someone's here. I hope it's the janitor. <laughs> Why do I think it's not the janitor? Oh, look, we found another. Oh, that's a fact card thing, is it? I might use something thin to raise the lock on the other side. I want to look at this fact card thing. Ooh, learning is fun. The life of James Smithson. Hmm. English chemist and mineralogist. Interesting. Alright, well, I guess we'll keep our eyes peeled for those cards as well as the Smithsonian logo things. Wow, 6 out of 49 already. Uh, let's see what this uh, machine over here is looking for. Aha! Money. So I'm not sure what happens if I put a quarter in. Oh, I see. I knew it. I had to collect one of each. Aha! All right, so I need a nickel and a penny. We don't even have pennies in Canada anymore. They stopped printing them. Everything that had a penny in it gets rounded up or down to the nearest nickel or the nearest five cents. Unless you're using Interact or a uh, credit card, then you'll pay to the exact penny. But if you're using actual cash, coins, there are no pennies. The stores won't even accept them. Hmm, it's like someone left this here for me to find. An ancient solid bronze statue stolen. Main suspect is a jewelry thief. Ah, that name sounds familiar. Hey look, James Smithson. May he find his final resting place at the institution he founded. Learning. What do we have here? Key. Looks like we're gonna have a hidden object scene over there, that's cool. It is in his knowledge that man has found his greatest, oh, his greatness and his happiness. Hmm. Interesting. Got the old American flag down there. That's looking good. Well, let's get into the clicky clicky, the searchy searchy, findy findy. Oh wow, what are we looking for? Huh. Interesting. We gotta find all of these crystals, apparently. So we have to find the last one. It looks like they've got some uh, chemistry symbols here too: sodium, nickel, uh, Br. Is that bromium? I think that's gold. Every time I th hear the word gold, I think of gold finger. <laughs> I don't know if that's strontium. I don't know what Sr is. Calcium. I think CD is cadmium. Anyways, focus, Gibbs, focus. <laughs> Come on now. Ah, look at that. See, I knew I was gonna have to get the, to that. Actually, I had no clue. I was just noticing that they were there. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Come on, get out of my way. I could have got six. Oh, here we go. Even more. Wow, this is a triple. Love it. Totally doing it. I bet you're gonna have to find. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Coffee's right there. 
compass? Why would there be a lock of hair? That's kind of weird. Saw, ice picks, and calipers. That's lock of the hair. Ooh, we found a morphing object. This game has everything. <laughs> Holy cow. Morphing objects? 17 of them. Okay, so I'm going to assume all of the hidden object scenes have morphing objects. Wow. So I've got fact cards. I've got uh, morphing objects. And I've got Smithsonian symbols. We've got loads of stuff to find, that's for sure. So what do we got left? We have a saw, ice pick, and a ruler. Oh, there's the saw and the ice pick. So now we just need a ruler. Oh, right there. Ooh, it has a nice steel edge on it. Yeah! Completed a hidden object puzzle without a hint. Well done. We found a ruler. I like how it's saying, way to go, Gibbs. You found a ruler. I don't know where this one goes. Oh, it goes there. Oh, I see fire as a nickel. Huh. Alright, well, let's, uh, can't go that way, so let's ruler it up. Nicely done. To the castle lobby. Hey, creepy. Come back here. I want to talk to you. Now I'm definitely sure I'm not seeing things. Yeah, I agree. Ooh, what's this all about? Huh. Fire? Oh, we're gonna have to get that fire symbol. Okay. Oops. I just want to check out the other ones while I'm here. Smithsonian. Hope Diamond. And an owl. Huh. Interesting. Why is that thing like that? File coin. What do we have over here? It's missing a knob, and I guess it's locked as well. I have a key, though. But I still need a knob. Hmm. Darn. Well, let's follow the ghosty. Ooh, he's a shadow. Oh, he's real. He's a ghost. Wait, stop! Who are you, and why are you running away from me? Follow the mysterious man. I don't know, he's kind of creepy. Hmm. Bobblehead collection. Wow, look at these crazy, crazy, goofy bobbleheads. Hmm. That's neat. Oh, we have a fact card. Oh my goodness, this game is going to have me back and forth. James Renwick selected to design the castle. Hmm. James Renwick won the competition to design the Smithsonian Institution building, or the castle. Lucky for him, I bet you he got paid very well. 9 out of 49. The cabinet is locked. Maybe I could find a way to cut the glass. We are going to have to get a diamond. You know it, and I know it. Alright, so we're going to have a morphing object in here, I'm guessing. Uh, I think that fella. Oh, is that actually cheese? Oh, I thought that was a card. Yeah, like a punch card. Oops. Alright, keep our eye peeled for morphing stuff, everyone. Hope Diamond. That's a nice Zeppelin up there. We need a handle. What does this even mean? I wonder, if, does it glow when we need to find one, or when we found one? I don't know. A snail and a glass cutter. Okay, well that's... There's our handle. A receipt. Interesting. So, for those of you that have watched me play other playthroughs, I am not a very good Morphe finder. That's uh, kind of my weakness, really. But I guess you could say my weakness right now is finding a snail! <laughs> huh. 
I actually was pretty good in uh, the latest Christmas stories because all the morphing objects were all penguins, so that was kind of easy to go, oh, there's a penguin, oh, there's a penguin. So that was actually relatively straightforward. Uh, but I think I still missed a couple, too. Okay, so where's the snail that we need? Anyone see the snail? Now, snail... Yes, the snail does have the shell. Um, okay, I thought I might have missed something. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, I need a pass card. Okay, let's, uh... Use that glass cutter. Oh, just let it fall on the ground? Wow. Hope is the thing with feathers that perches in the soul and sings the tunes without the words and never stops at all. Emily Dickinson. Hey, Bubblehead. Anything else I get to keep? No. A spyglass. Well, we've got three out of four of Bubbleheads. Can we just use the bat here? No. That's ridiculous. What do we have over here? Do I have a map? I think I have a map. I haven't even looked at this in forever. Looks like we can go here. Wait. Locations where you have something to do. Um. What do I have to do here? Oh wow, that actually... Was meant to go there? Oh, we are actually making the coin. Oh, that's kind of neat. I love these machines. You put a quarter in and it squishes it and makes a symbol. It's kind of neat. Okay, so I can make the owl because I don't have the rolly thing. But I have the diamond. Well, let's go put the diamond away then. Uh, hope diamond. Hopefully we get something useful out of that. Mmm. Bobblehead! And a machine, a recorder. Let's go and do the bobblehead collection. Boom! Swap the bobbleheads so that the heads are on the right figures. The names on the pedestal will light up when correct. Oh. Okay, I think that might be in Oakley. Yay! Ooh, Robert Lee, I got that correct too. That's gotta be George Washington. Really? No, that's... No, wait, that's... Uh, that's a blinking. Uh, that's George Washington. It's kind of funny how I know a little bit about American figures here. Ben Franklin. That's Ben Franklin. Uh, Ulysses Grant. I think that's... No, that's him there. No, that's a lady. That's Ulysses Grant. Pretty sure he has facial hair. Yep. Douglas. That's gotta be the pilot. J. Edgar Hoover is a man. Teddy Roosevelt. Yay! Look at us go with the bobbleheads! Ooh! Penny! I like me a penny. Let's go make another... Press some more coins here. That will take me over to the fire one. Go! fire time. Let's go put the fire one in now. We'll have to figure out what the uh, recorder's for. Ooh, ooh. Oh, battery! No sooner spoken than broken. Wait, I know the answer. It's silence, and the leopard's roar is something that breaks it. Hey, you got a door handle. 
All right, we are in great shape here. We got two out of the four there. We're going to take a break here, and we'll see you in the next episode of Hidden Expedition. Thanks for watching, everyone. Let me know what you think of the game so far. I know it's kind of early, but I'd love to hear your thoughts down in the comments below.